Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy. Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how to connect any printer to your Android device. And the reason why I say any printer is because any printer that's connected to uh, any computer at home will be able to do this. So how we get to the Google Cloud Print is you're on Chrome, so you do have to have a Chrome browser account, sign into your Gmail account, and once you do, you're going to click up at the top corner of settings, and then you're going to go right here to show advanced settings. And under that, we're going to go all the way down until we get to Google Cloud Print. And we're going to hit add printers, and that takes me to the screen that I was originally at. Um, now, it does tell you right here that if you did want to add uh, local printers, you click the Add Printers. There are some printers that are cloud-ready printers, which just means they are wireless. So this would be, is where you would go for wireless printers. I'm going to show you how to click a regular printer right now. And so we're going to go to Add Printers. And what this will do is this will bring up any printer that you have connected to your computer. So now I can manage my printer connected to my computer. So um, you can always add more later on. So you can see right here, add a classic printer. And it just tells you the exact thing. And you can, um, to make sure it is connected, you can print out a test page. And this is my printer right here. And you can just print out a test page like so. And that's the entire process. And if you can hear in the background, uh, my printer is about to print. Although I'm going to try to cancel it before it does. Unfortunately, at this point, I will be unsuccessful by doing that. But this is how um, you would set it up. And once this is set up, then we're going to download this app right here, which is called Cloud Print. So under Cloud Print, uh, we will be printing out from our Android device. And this will be under the second part of this video. Okay, guys, so on the second part of this video, we're going to show an Android device and how you would print from it. So first thing we're going to do is go to the Play Store, and we're going to search, and we're going to type in Cloud Print. And this will be the first app that comes up. And you're going to install the app. I have installed it. So as soon as you do, just open it right up. Now when you open it right up, it's going to tell you all about it and how to set it up. If you haven't yet, of course, we've already set it up. So we will choose our email and allow access at the very bottom right here. And we can, uh, if you want to choose your printer, um, you can already just choose a Google Cloud Print. Now, HP's ePrinters have a different setting for this, and of course, there's other printers available. But we already set it up ours through Google Cloud Ready, so now we're just syncing that up. And then we see all of our other devices as well, and I, of course, and the Android guys. So I have a lot of devices. But yes. Um, I'm going to go to my printer, which is this one right here, and this will be the default printer, and now I'm going to print a test page, and you'll be able to hear the test page print. Now, the really nice part about this is that you can send this from anywhere. You can be on the go. Anywhere you have internet access, you can actually print. And this is what's really nice about this, is you can actually print when you're on the go from it. So it's really nice that you have this ability to do this. Um, now we're going to go next. And then um, you can go Pro if you want to get the Pro version. Um, I'll explain that. You can just do printing from things such as Facebook and Dropbox as well when you get the Pro version. However, if we want to move this way, you can see you can locally, uh, there's local 
main menu and web at the very top right here. So, local will print out files you have here, pictures you have, drawings, SMSs, so you can actually print out your text messages, uh, contacts, uh, notepad, and even scan documents. You can also print out things from the web. So, anything from Google Drive, uh, Google Calendar, Mail, again, if we go to Facebook, it'll most likely tell me, uh, yes, of course, so, I have five days to print out from Facebook to enjoy it, um, and after that, I can get the Pro version. Um, so, that is how you would do that, but it's just a nice way that they allow you to uh, test it out before actually getting it. So this is how you can actually print from your Android device and you print out basically anything you would want to print, uh, whether it be a text message, picture, contacts, file, um, if you want to go online to web, and this is how you would do it all. Alright guys, um, I'm gonna, just going to go into settings, you can actually change your printer settings here as well. So you can make it under portrait or landscape, as we see right here, how many copies. Um, and just change anything you would normally change on your printer, which is really nice, of course. That you have that kind of accessibility. You can change your accounts. And just different things you can do from here. So these are the basic things you can do. If we were to get the pro version, uh, what it does, just as I'm showing you at the top, just so you can see how it is, is um, it removes cloud, um, the ads, it does unlimited printing for Facebook photos, unlimited printing for Dropbox documents, and all pre premium features to be released later on. So these are the different things that you can do if you do get the uh, pro version. So, um, just a really simple uh, app, and it allows you to print anything you want from your device. Alright guys, if you have any questions, feel free to ask. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the Android Guy.